guys, it's Ashley from Not A Tree Reviews and today we are here with Ipsy Plus. This is not Ipsy Ultimate. Ipsy Ultimate doesn't ship yet. <laughs> But they do have a new subscription, which is something that I want to mention here because I've said it on my blog But I know a lot of you guys are YouTube people and you don't do the blog thing Ipsy has uh, a new upgraded kind of almost like boxy Lux, uh, Which you can get but I think it's monthly. I'm not sure that I should have clarified uh, But it is the ultimate package. Um, it starts in October <clears throat> I am too broke to afford that with Boxy Lux, so I'm just gonna do Ipsy Plus for a little bit. <laughs> All right, so Ipsy Plus is like an upgraded version of the original Ipsy bag. Now, now that they've introduced the Ultimate subscription, they are gonna start putting all of their things in bags. The bags will just change in size, is my kind of understanding. This is $25 a month. They do obviously have a $10 bag. If you didn't know that, it's a beauty subscription. They send samples in the $10. This is more full-sized. Actually, it's all full-sized. It's amazing. Now, last month I had a hit, like it was like home run for me, right out of the park. I looked at the email, because you can kind of, they send you like, oh, do you want to peek in your box? And I'm like, yes, what? Who wouldn't? Uh, and I was a little disappointed. I just, I just was. I don't like to complain because these are a tremendous value. Um, they're just amazing. They're just amazing boxes. Like to get all these kinds of beauty products, you wouldn't be able to do this. No matter where you shop, even if you go to like Walmart, you know what I mean? Like it's just not possible. Um... So it is a deal. If you're a girl on a budget, you have 25 bucks a month, maybe you even got $10. If that's all you have, do the little bag. I mean, uh, but you know, when you compare it to the month before, I'm not trying to be a brat. I'm just saying, I hate being a brat about it because I do understand what a deal it is because there are boxes out there where I'm like, but then you, t this is a bigger company. You kind of have higher expectations. Do you see, the, do you see what I'm saying? You see what I'm saying? Anyway. I'm gonna link down below to my full review. I will also link to Ipsy with my referral. I do get, uh, you know, I get like a, what do we get if you, like somebody subscribes, you get points, and then they have a point system where you can go on and get things in their little shop. They do also have add-ons. So when they come out with a box, when you know that the box is coming up, you can select things for extra additional costs um, and add them onto your box. I don't usually do that, I just, I just feel like I have so much already. <laughs> this is fun, but uh, a lot of it I give away because I do this for you guys. I do it for my blog. It's, you know, but I can't use everything. I just can't. I just don't use that much. And there are products that I get, and there's something in here uh, that I won't use. I just don't use them. All right, so you get your little insert. This is Find Your Light. September's all about new paths and possibilities, so whether it's going all out with a bold new lip shade or masking at home to recharge from within. Take a moment to rediscover your guiding North Star. Where will it lead you? Discover yourself. So when you open this up, it's gonna list each of the products. So first up, we have an item from Glam Glow. This is probably really exciting for most people. I, I don't know what to say. Am I excited? Maybe. All right, so this is a Tropical Cleanse Daily Exfoliating Cleanser. I like cleansers. I think that this is, overall, their products for me. I know people love them because my skin is just so picky. I have a good thing going on, and I kind of don't want to mess it up. Does that make sense? Like, all right, so this is $34, though. So now, glam for most people, I'm talking for myself, for most people, They'd love to receive this. Like if you're into skincare, you like that kind of stuff. I'm not being a brat. I'm not trying to be a brat. So, um, this is a great product. This is great. And it's well over the value of the box itself. So yes, it's a good thing. For me personally, eh, not, sw not, not swooning or whatever. All right. I'm just going to get the bad things out of the way first. Not that this is bad. Oh, I hate saying that. Ah. All right. I... I'm gonna try this out and I wanna like it. But I had the other mask I got in like BoxyCharm, what was that? And I didn't, it didn't work for me. No, no. All right, next we have the Ciate London Extraordinary Translucent Powder. I just straight up, I'm gonna put this in a giveaway or I'm gonna pass it on to a friend. Um, this is valued at $22, I don't use it. By the way though, I'll say this. 
Last month in BoxyCharm, we got the Becca, that crazy Hydra setting powder. That stuff, I don't use setting powder. I will never not have that. Like, I will buy that for the rest of my life as long as they carry it. Please don't discontinue that. Um, I don't know what it does. It does not. Like, usually for my dry, dry skin, I'm like, I can't use, or I'll put it like maybe just a little bit on my nose if I'm not going to be wearing my makeup all day or I'm going to be outside. Um, but I put that on and it just does, I don't know what it does. It does something. And I'm like, wow, everything just looks so complete. Just, it just completes the entire look. I love that stuff. So this is not the same thing. Uh, Ciate is a great brand. I just don't use setting powder. So I'll be passing that on or something. All right. Next up. The item I'm probably most excited about is from, um, this is the Ofra Madison Miller Midi Palette Miller Squad. I think it's a contour highlight, you know, one of those sorts of palettes. I love these. I could, there's things that like, I think everybody, like I can never have too many of those. I can have way too many of those, you know, uh, anything involving highlight. I'm like, I want, can I ever open this up? Lord, come on. I didn't take my pictures yet do this to me. What are you guys watching on Netflix or Hulu? What are you watching? I am, I just watched the Wu-Tang. It's like, it's made by RZA and it kind of like introduces you to all of the members. It's very cool. I'm trying to make small talk while I, I'm just gonna have to rip it, I think. Jeez, am I like not very intelligent? I got it. But anyway, I was watching that last night and fell asleep on my couch. Um, so here it is. Mine has like little smudges and I don't like them. You see that? There's like smudges. See that? What? 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 I don't like that. That's not good. But the packaging's cute. It's white. I do like white. It's going to get all smudged up. You know that. All right. So there is that. I always look because I one time saw like a, a little in my box, something from BoxyCharm. So, is this not, what are these? Apply blush and highlight to the high points of the face to give the appearance of more lifted features and a glowing radiant complexion. So, it's a blush and two highlights? I thought it was a contour, like a, I think there's different ones, cause this one here looks way more peach. This is $35 by the way. This three-piece palette collab from Ofra and content creator Madison Miller is all about that go that to go glow. Highly pigmented and a cinch to blend, this rosy combo of blush and highlighter creates a lit from within look. Blush and highlighter in mere minutes. Okay, which one is this? Is there more than one? I'm guessing it's the. All right, whatever. I guess I'll never know. The one here looks way more peachy. Um, so here's that first. That's pretty. It's like a pinkish, pinky, like pearl kind of. The blush, by the way, I'm gonna say this right now. This pan is not in right. I can move it, which is kind of a bummer, right? On their part, not Ipsy's part, not Ipsy's fault. Uh, the blush is very faint, but that's kind of good because honestly, like who wants like a super crazy blush that like goes on, you know, clown makeup. It's a very pretty and kind of subtle and kind of more what I like, to be honest, like I like an orangey. I don't like pink. It's not very flattering on my skin. All right. Then finally we have this one here. Ooh, it's just way more like a champagne, like a gold, very pretty sun kissed. Um, nice. They're nice. I do not like, like this pan here is look, look, it came right out. Tisk, tisk, Ofra. Tisk, tisk. All right. <laughs> All right. Next we have, <clears throat> this is from Wander Beauty. They've been in a lot of these Ipsy boxes. I was not aware of this brand before I had them in the Ipsy. Uh, so fewer, better beauty essentials. So 
that's their like little frame your face micro brow pencil uh, this is another item I can't have too many of these um, I can't have enough is what I should have said I love them I really do and it's still shed you little devils that's cool I don't want to stab myself on the camera. All right. It really is a thin, thin, thin pencil. You got your spoolie on this end and then you've got this. What color is this? Oh, it's dark. I do not, the reds look really bad on my eyebrows. Um, is there not a color? Oh, dark brown. <laughs> All right, let's uh, go right here. here. That's kind of nice. I like that. I'll go along with this. It's like waxy. That's kind of good though. You want it to be like really, really stay put. Um, but it doesn't like, you don't in, like just have to go really lightly. It's you kind of take some work. So I like that about it. <clears throat> you got to build it up, you know? All right, so this is thirty-one dot no twenty-one. Sorry, I was like thirty-one for a brow pencil. You are crazy, you is crazy. All right, our final item. This is from Ilamasca. This is the anti-matter lipstick in midnight. I guess there was only one color this uh, month. I feel like they sent something like a lip liner a few months ago. Was that them? Ooh, a square, you don't see this often. This is like, not, I feel like this is 90s. The 90s did like the square lipsticks. Uh, so this is valued at $27. All right. Oh, that's a red red. Oh, she red red. All right. Ooh, that's beautiful. That like, by the way, gl just like watch. I'm gonna go so light. It's crazy. That's a beautiful, beautiful color. And it's like super matte. It's, it's lipstick. I mean, we're not going to be too angry. I don't wear red often, but this one is nice. I will mess around with that. All right. So in our box, like I'm going to be like straight up. I think that it's a good deal. It's an amazing deal. I'm not going to argue that. Um, this, that pan. That's a bummer. I am not like, I know some of you will be like, ah, message Gypsy, send it back. No, girl, it'll be fine. I just will always remember not to turn it upside down or anything. Um, that's why there is, if you look here on the mirror, there's this circle. That's why. Um, Cause it, there, it may break. If it breaks, then I will. But that's a nice item though, other than the pan that didn't stand. This lipstick's amazing. Uh, this, for most people, you would they'd be thrilled to have this, so I'm not gonna complain. Uh, the translucent powder, I won't use, but tons of people use it. I think on my survey, though, I've made it clear that I don't really want those. Um, and the brow pencil, I can always use these. I seem to go through these really quick or I lose them. Um, so I do like this box, I don't love. You know what I mean? Like, it's not one of those months where I'm like, wow! I actually, my I'm kind of disappointed. My Boxy Lux is supposed to be here. It's not here. It's not supposed to be here. It should be here. It's now the 11th. Um, so I'm hoping it shows up today so I can get a video up at some point in, in time. Uh, anyway, I will link down below to my full review where we'll go in depth. We'll talk about everything. Um, and I'll also link to Ipsy with my referral, like I said before. As always, thank you guys so, so, so much for watching. I'll see you next time.